Hi, I'm Makia Rai. Today we're in Ginza. Ginza is a premier shopping district of Japan with many long-standing businesses, department stores, and high-end boutiques. Today we'll be introducing you to something that you can only enjoy here. It's this, honey. We arrive at an 11-floor office building in the Yonchome section of Ginza. Going up to the roof and passing the AC units. Hello. What do you do here? We run a bee farm. The Ginza Honey Bee Project was launched in 2006. And the honey produced atop a building in the middle of the city is something you can only get here. Go in slowly. How many bees do you keep here? At uh, this time of year, about 80,000. 80,000? That sounds like a lot! <gasps> wow! This is the honey frame. Maki, try some. Ah, wow! So, how does it taste? It has a very fragrant aroma. Where do the bees get the pollen? They get it from beyond those high rises at Hibiya Park and the Imperial Palace grounds. Honey bees travel about 1.5 kilometers in five minutes and typically fly for five to ten minutes at a time. There's a massive source of honey around here, so the taste and sweetness change every week. That's what makes it exciting for us beekeepers. Today we're in Ginza, the premier shopping district of Japan. This department store sells many products using honey made in Ginza. Matsuya Ginza is one of the top department stores in the area. We went down to the food section on the basement floor. So, this must be it, Ginza honey. Labeo is a nationwide chain of shops specializing in honey. This shop in Matsuya Ginza is their only one offering Ginza honey products. What are the characteristics of Ginza honey? It has a very refreshing taste. Do other shops have similar products? The honey is used in products of more than 10 brands, such as Kurakichi and Ginza Bunmeido. Ginza is the main store for Matsuya, so we believe collaboration with Matsuya-related brands is very important. We've been involved in the Ginza Honey Project from the year after they started producing honey. One place to taste Ginza honey in Ginza is Cafe Bar Ginza 328. Thank you for waiting. Hi. This is the honey toast. Mm. So, how does toast covered in Ginza honey taste? <laughs> the honey really matches the bread and the butter, and it's really nice. I love it, it's delicious. Today we introduced you to honey made in the premier shopping district of Ginza. I hope you enjoyed it.